Oh, he's jumping, jumping. What the hell? Is this team rocket? What's going on? Why is it? So we just... <laughs> Welcome back. I'm Kieran, and I've been getting into a ton of new fighting games recently. Psy Games, who worked on a mobile game that I really liked, that unfortunately is dead now, released a brand new fighting game in February. So I want to check out every character in the base game and their super to see if the game is for me and who I want to main if I do play. Massive shout out to new subscribers of the day, Alucard and Jaguar. All right, so who we got? We got Gran. Oh, so the main protagonist of Gran Blue is called Gran? Fair enough. <laughs> and we got Jita. She's really cute. Are they Jita. siblings? Or is it just like the male and female protagonist characters? Is it like Lumine and Aether in um, Genshin Impact, maybe? That's what I'm getting from that. So this is a Skybound art? Oh, he's zooming through. Okay. That's kind of cool. It's like he charges his energy at the tip of the sword and then fences it into them. That's kind of dope. This one's pretty basic. I wonder if they get like any more animated, you know? What does Jita's look like? First of all, Jita, mad cute. Look at the bounce. <laughs> oh, he bounces too. All right, what you got, Jita? What the hell? Wait, why is her so much cooler? Jesus. Hold on. Run that back. It looked like she summoned a bunch of swords. Like she was a homeboy from Fate. Gilgamesh. That's the one. Thank you. I feel so sorry for Gran. <laughs> He's the main character. He got like the worst Skybound art. Okay. So we're going we're gonna to try the Super Skybound art and see if it's much different. All right. Let's go. Oh. But what the hell? Who was that behind her? What? She got dragon now? Wait, that's mad cool. This reminds me of um, an anime I saw recently called Berserk of Gluttony, where like these massive chimera had... <laughs> Sorry, I'm just processing what happened. But these massive chimera had like humans inside them. Is that like... Is that blue girl, the dragon? What is going on there? All right, the grand blue lore is deep. I can believe it off of what I just saw. All right, so I didn't realize that there was like an ultimate form, so we need to go back and do it with Gran. Hopefully, his is way more impressive. Who the hell is this blue girl? Wait, do they all have JoJo stands? They all have these partners. And he has a dragon too? Red eyes, black dragon. What the hell? So they're all just destroying the world with these dragons. I'm wondering if every character has like a dragon or a stand. Because that's crazy. This is actually way more similar to Dragalia Lost than I thought. Okay, so we got Catalina this time. She given vibes of uh, Jean from Genshin Impact. It's a regular one. What we got? Oh, I like the animation change up too. The spin. Wait, did she just put the power of many weapons in one? And why can they all just summon? They're all Gilgamesh from Fate. That's what's going on here. I love these animations though. They are so freaking cool. Now, what's her super skybound art? Oh, she's spiraling up. Wait, was that a knight? They all literally have stands. That's so interesting. She's Polar from JoJo. <laughs> With the, sh the fencing sword and the, the knight. That's kind of funny. Silver Chariot. I see you. Okay. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> She's so small. So she's like a little elf. She seems to have like elf ears. What's this sword? Okay, that's adorable. That, look at the, the crown. She really making up for something there in terms of the height. All right. What's she got going on? Oh, she spins at a will. Okay, Sayu. That's kind of dope. I like this one. <laughs> okay, she's cute. Also, how does her crown not hit the ground while she rolls? And then we got her super sky bound up. Are we rolling even more? Beyblade mode? Jesus. Okay, Power Ranger. <laughs> okay, that's funny. She does the whole Super Sentai Kamen Rider thing of the explosion in the back. Charlotta is very cool. So is she like Queen of the Elves or something? I'm so interested in the lore just based on the character designs and the moves going on here. Like, this is fascinating. Lancelot. All right, you're kind of cool. You got the dual swords like Kirito. Even the way he spanned them. I just started playing the Trails games and he's giving a bit of air of Joshua about him. One of the main characters. Like crossing them swords. 
okay. The quick movement and the kick up. Like Shishirenden from Sasuke. That was kind of cool. That was kind of dope. What's this super look like? Oh, he jumped back. So we can summon ice. Oh, we're frozen in it like Annie from Attack on Titan. It's done. That's sick. So he can manifest the powers of ice. I really want to know how like the magic and the lore works. Is it just that every character can produce or has their own element of magic as well? Percival. I've seen a little bit of Percival because my friend Viram plays him. So I know the redheaded wonder. His sword is mad long. I don't think I processed this. <laughs> All right, what's his uh, skybound art though? The fire sword. Is that Bakugo's voice? He's kind of cool though. Like his sword has ridges on it. Like it looks like a Beyblade ripcord. What's his super skybound? Jesus. The fire tornado or your clap. Did it. <laughs> Wait, he really might be Bakugo with the fire explosion telling them to die. That's kind of funny. I understand it. I understand the love. La Diva, like Beyonce? This is a whole wrestler with horns. Wait, are you fancy? Yo, Slay, let's go. <laughs> you really are. I mean, you have Diva in the name. This is such a good character. Oh my god. Wait, you an elf too, though? The drop kick. Should have expected it from a wrestler. The little heart, though, that's so funny. It's giving me vibes of like if Bon Clay from One Piece was massive and blonde, maybe. Is Ladiva a fan favorite of anyone's? I need to know. All right, what's Ladiva's super skybound, though? Let's see it. Oh, the hug? Oh, we just throw it. Incineroar? <laughs> Yo, there's a whole referee. There is no way. There is a whole referee out here. Sorry, that just caught me off guard. I should have expected it, but yeah, okay. Ladiva is already one of my favorite characters. She has one of the best Super Skybounds, and if you get to three, you get a different ending. So there's different animations for the different pin counts. All right, get that free count. Let's go, Ladiva. I want to see it. Two. Three. Let's go. <laughs> so it just does the whole you win, basically. I wanted to see a celebration from Ladiva, but I respect it. Matera. It's not the bunny girl. You are cool, though. You can fly? What do you have, Matera? The fire flip Beyblade kick. Let's go. Fire arrows. Okay, she's cool. Why am I falling in love with all the characters? All right, now Super Skybound. What we got? This isn't fire. What the hell did you just... <laughs> okay, Jotaro. I'm not gonna lie, that caught me off guard. So she's quick with the kicks to that animation. Okay, I like that. She was just kicking him up like she was Sanji. Low Wayne. Like Lil Wayne? Oh, he's jumping, jumping. What the hell? Is this Team Rocket? What's going on? Why is it? So we just. <laughs> he had homeboys come and carry him, but why? Like, how does that affect the combat? I need to see moves. Before that and after that to see what... Oh, okay. He summons his friends anyway in the combat. All right. Let's see that again and see if he can attack. Okay. This is ridiculous. <laughs> All right. So it makes his attacks a lot stronger. That's cool. Now, is his super skybound art going to be a lot different? Or like how... Like, I don't know. Is he going to summon an extra homie? How does that work? What? Is this a goddess? I love her design. I feel like it. What? <laughs> Bro summoned a whole waifu. It's like when the Power Rangers combine to become the Megazord. The three homies combine to become a waifu. Is that what I've just seen? Guys. <laughs> These are genuinely amazing. I'm not going to lie. I love this. I didn't expect there to be like this much comedy and humor in these go go power wife <laughs> oh she got a whip how were you supposed to attack her are her moves just slower guy bound it up did her whip just turn into a whole animal what the hell was that 
Okay, no, you gotta show me the super. What the? Is that a dog? Isn't this homeboy from um, the Nightmare Before Christmas? Wow, first of all, that was showing off angles of her character design during that. Here we go after Fairy. Zeta? That's a sick name. Um, is her armor similar to Percy's? I wonder if they're from like the same region or if they're related in a way. We'll see. She looks very cute though. There we go. She got... Oh, wait, was that fire shield? She had fire, but it seemed like there were like barriers around the fire also. That was mad interesting. All right, what else we got here? What we... Oh, we trapping him in a barrier. So she does do barrier magic. That's busted. Trapped homie in a barrier and then busted the Kamehameha up on it. Thing is though, if you're protecting him... Oh, I guess her attack passes through her own barrier. That makes sense. Vasiraga. Yo, homie's big. He's massive, dude. He takes up half the screen. Let's go. Oh, my way. More Shinderu. What kind of magic is that? The Beyblade Scythe? You know what's really interesting? Uh, who was a little elf girl from the start? <laughs> Their attacks are kind of similar. I guess, like, fair enough with a scythe. Spinning in a circle is, like, gonna do damage. I get that. This voice act is really familiar too, by the way. Oh, he's doing slashes on slashes on slashes. Bro just blew up the entire earth with purple magic. Okay. <laughs> How are we still on this ship? He seems very interesting though. I wonder what exactly his lore is. Like, I'm wondering if he's even human. Namaya? She's so little. I didn't expect her to be this little. She's like a ram. Oh. She got the Beyblade butterfly spin. Love it. Oh, her sword is epic, though. I'm not going to lie. She looked like a whole demon slayer. Hold on. Did she just attack without attacking? She attacked with the hilt of the sword. That's hilarious. Oh, it changes. Oh, you have to actively take her sword out to attack differently. So it was like a stance thing. All right. What's the super? The EI technique, but going crazy. Oh, bro, it's sushi now. It's done. That was so pretty, dude. I really like her design, though. Zoris. Who is this guy? Man, he got the flares on? Okay, we see you, fashion. Bro, summon a whole lion and dragon. What the hell? That was the most Liu Kang thing I've seen today. Bro, got the blue and the red. You're going crazy. Okay, what's his super? I didn't expect the eight gates to open, my guy. So he takes his clothes off. He just strips. That's his super. That's that's interesting. So does this ever run out? Oh, he has another one if you do it again. Okay, bet. Oh. I think I'm crazy with the punches now. Now that he's naked. He sent him straight back to the manga. I don't even know if this series has a manga. But anytime anybody does any animation like that, it hits. It reminds me of that one Luffy punch in Saba Odiak of One Piece. Nah. That was... That might be the coolest one. Zooey. Is it said like Zooey or is it just said like Zoe? Because it could be Zoe, but she a little bit of an animal, you know? She got the sword and shield. This is the most reminiscent character of Link I've seen all day. And Gran is right there. Zoe, what you got? She can teleport. Into space? Did she just open a domain expansion in Kamehameha? Dude, these animations are so freaking cool. This must be one of the most fun fighting games to watch just off the animations. Did she just... Monster Musume? Wait, that was really freaking cool. I'm not gonna lie, it's hard for me to tell if she's just riding the dragon or if she combined with it. Alright, it's always cool. I like her. Cagliostro. Oh, she's small too. It always catches me off guard when I change to a character and they're small. She out here reading books. She looks very Dragalia lost too, though. All right, what's she got? Literally summon Beyblades. I know I can't stop talking about Beyblades today, but what else am I supposed to call that? 
She does spells and magic with the book. So I'm guessing it's like a, grim a grimoire. Ooh, that personality change. Is she good? <laughs> she made a golden statue out of herself. That's 10 out of 10. I already like her personality based on the five seconds I've seen of her. She turned him into a whole statue where she might us. Oh, here like Austin Powers gold member. What just happened? Yule. It's time to Yule. Oh, I like her stance. She's a rabbit girl too. Oh, wait, no. She looked more like a fox. She's like Ari from League of Legends. The big bushy tail. All right, what we got? I'm confused. All right, what we got? Oh, she's spinning, spinning. I'm not going to make the Beyblade reference. <laughs> She's so cute, though. Ooh, she set him ablaze. This is literally some Demon Slayer type beat. Wait, another fox? Or is that... So she summons a home girl and they, they yin and yang it up together? I might need a break just because of... <laughs> they do be spinning around like Baraka from um, Mortal Kombat. You're right. I might need a break just because I'm so overwhelmed by how awesome these are. Anre, hold on. From that picture, that looked like... What's the Bro look like a Yordle from League of Legends. That literally, am I the only one seeing it? What you got though? You got a long spear. That range probably goes crazy. Okay. Let me not talk bad about him. He's summoning space and time. Okay, he's kind of cool. He's kind of cool. Ooh, the start? Where are you sending me? Jesus. I need to know, I need to know Anre's law. Why can he do this? Why can he control space and time? Dialga and Palkia style. That's freaking dope. Yeah. Is it even a ponytail? That, that thing stays up. Eustace. Eustace kid, let's go. He's got a gun? Can he use this? Oh, it looked more like a taser actually. Okay. All right, he's bringing the knife out. Oh, he's zapping him up. Okay, that's cool. This this is the one that's felt almost the most like quote like basic since uh Grand's regular one at the start. But let's check out his super. Ooh. He charging that thing. He just break the entire screen like Persona 5. Get him! He summoned in lightning from the sky. That's that one Sasuke move for sure. He's kinda cool though. You thought that last guy was Arthur from Ghost and Goblins? <laughs> Seox? Se is it like... Do I pronounce the X? Is it Seox? Oh, you're cool. Wolverine? Alright, what are we doing? Oh! Can he use this if it's not full moon? Like, <laughs> it don't matter what day it is, it's always a full moon with him out. That was kind of cool though. I like the animation. All right, what's the super? That celestial was hell. Wait, so he's not even a shadow clone. It's like stars and moon clone. So he can create clones out of like celestial magic or something. That's pretty cool. Oh, it's from the same group as Anre and they're called the Eternals. That makes sense because it is kind of like space time magic that they seem to be using. Vera. Right, what does Vera do? She does look quite a lot like a Genshin Impact character here. Oh, you got Vera. Why did it look like you were wearing a wedding dress for a second? Oh, so when you do it again? Jesus. Okay, so it's... That makes sense. So anytime a character kind of like seems to be powering up, do it again and then their real Skybound will appear. But does she have a super variant of that? Alright, we're flashing them up. Wait, what's that? Looks like Navi from... I'm scared of her? She's... I kind of like her. Like, because her character design seems really cute, but she also seems quite sadistic, you know? Who we got next? Anila? Oh, it's another Ram Lady! Okay. You know I like the Ram Ladies already. She's so cute. Look at her eyebrows. What the hell is that? When the Usopp hammer was that? She had like little bamboo popping out of that. <laughs> oh, 
saw the sheep that popped out. Wait, I think I main her. Guys, I'm maining her. The journey's over. I found it. It's her. Anilla is my character. It's done. It's over. Okay, what's her... her, her what is her super skybound, though? She has a little yawn. Okay, we love her. She's the best character. All right, what we got, lady? Okay, she's summoning more sheep. Well, she definitely sent that boy to sleep. That's for sure. <laughs> All right, guys, it's official. Chocolate Kieran is an Anilla main. Like, even just her moves. Like, I love that. She can summon the... Nah, okay, it's done. Actually, for real. Safe read, okay. So we got Rave Master and we got um, Fairy Tail. He moves very slow, Siegfried. All right, let's go. What is Siegfried Skybound? Oh! Dude! The direction of making these is incredible. Like, I love... Like, if this was happening in an anime, everyone would be popping off about the animation and, like, the, the change in direction that they show. Like, dude, it's so great. Now, what's this super? Did Vayne just pop out of his cheek? Has he got... What happened to him? Did he just have a friends and family anime power-up mid, mid super? Did he lose all his friends and family and unleash his showering gun? Because that's what it felt like. They just keep getting better and better. That's what I'm saying. Like, these are actually really freaking good. Grimnir. Oh, no. Grimnir seems like they're going to be cool. Is this our uh, Shao from Genshin Impact? You got wind magic? All right, let's go. Whoa, that's cool. You Jojo pose to begin with. You're just throwing a hit. Excellent. Send Grimnir to the Olympics, because that was a world record-breaking throw, surely. What is your super, though? Oh! Did she just take them to space? Okay, James from Team Rocket with a rose. I like that with the, the pose. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Nier? Hold on. Speaking of Nier, is it this game? That 2B from near is in? She's so slow and scared. Okay, I'm... Oh, you can do magic? All right, what's your skybound? Tarot cards? She literally has a JoJo stand, though, for real. So she loses control of her emotions and her powers come out is what I'm getting from that. Let's see how it manifests in a super skybound. What? It's just a parry. So I need to be attacked to use the super skybound? Wait, ho she's just there now. Okay, I need to probably turn on the attack animation. You gonna attack me? Okay, not yet. Come here. Oh God, not like that, please. Quick, attack me. Okay, I did it, there we go. So it's literally a whole counter. Ooh, that was kind of cool. <laughs> she's just standing there. Menacingly, that's the, the super skybound. <laughs> so personally for me, even with like Greninja and Smash Bros, like I wasn't like using counters a lot. So I always find it hard to use uh, counters in, in fighting games. Billsy Bob, we got the devil himself. You're kind of cool and you can fly. It looks like you're standing on the ground, but you're kind of not, are you? He's like barely hovering. Unclear. All right, what we got? Is that Dio's voice? Chifumito. All right, Dio, what else you got? That's Sasuke's curse mode. That's a freezer death beam if I've ever seen one. Death ball, rather. Dude, he's kind of cool, actually. That's really freaking cool. Reward me, guys. I haven't called anyone a Beyblade and like... 10 characters. Belial. Oh, you're fancy, dude. You look like you should be in like Final Fantasy 15 or something. All right, Belial, what you got? Oh, we are running them up. Was that like a... I was going to say, it looked like a magic circle behind them. Interesting. You thought you were playing Grand Blue Fantasy, but it was I. Deal. <laughs> 
honestly fair. <laughs> did your eyes just, did the whites of your eyes just go black? Are we transforming? What are you? So you're a demon. Are you related to Beelzebub? Is Belly also another name for the devil? That was freaking cool though. I like at this point, what more do you want me to say? These are all just amazing. Avatar Belly or Avatar for who? Beelzebub? Please do not kill Gran. We're just trying to see some some super. Alright, so this is what he looked like in his Jesus, bloodied up my whole screen. Relax. This... <laughs> so this is the state he looked in in the last uh, skybound that we saw. But what is super skybound here? This isn't the last character though, because we need to go back and we need to revisit two characters who I missed out on a couple of their like special case ones. <laughs> oh, hit with the JoJo ASMR. What? Wait, so you put him in a different unit? So you made him so small, compact him up, and then crushed him. Like, did you put him in a different universe that was the palm of your hand? Like, I don't... Dude, I, I actually really need to... Is there a story in this game as well? I am very fascinated by the Grand Blue story as a whole now. You definitely got to catch me playing the RPG when it comes out February. Yeah, to be honest, if this game has its own story mode, maybe I should, I should play that too. Right, so apparently I missed Vera's standard Super Skybound. <laughs> What's she doing? Oh my god! She's a masochist. I mean, she's a sadist. She's a sadist. The spikes caught me off. God, I'm not gonna lie. Why do I like this character? Bro, she looked like she should belong in that one anime that just came out, Chain Soldier. <laughs> Alright, and the final is Beelzebub's. So Beelzebub has another one I missed out on. Oh, what the hell? Wait, are you doing the same thing that Belial just did? Like turning us so small? What kind of powers do these people have? I need to know the magic system. I need to know everything about Grand Blue. The animation, the art, all of these have been beautiful. To be honest, for the visuals alone, this is 10 out of 10. I actually kind of want to get into learning this. When my Steam Deck comes, it's over. Yeah, if you guys have any tips as far as how to get good at this game leave them in the comments if you want to see me play more of this let me know what kind of content you want out of me whether that's a story because i am fascinated by the law if you want me to try and get good and you want to see that let me know i need the cosplays of vanilla where are the vanilla cosplays <laughs>